Today, I want to give you three principles of sowing and reaping. Before I go into it, let me say this. Your life is like a garden and every day you are sowing into the garden. When you understand these principles, you can live a fruitful life as a child of God. So let me start. Principle number one, you reap what you sow. Galatians chapter six, verse seven. Paul said, do not be deceived for God is not mocked for whatsoever you sow that you shall reap. A farmer understands this principle. You cannot sow a watermelon seed and expect to harvest carrots. Whatever you put into the ground, that's exactly what you're going to get out of it. Your harvest will be determined by the seed that you sow. So if you don't like your harvest, all you have to do is to change the seed that you're putting into the ground. Principle number two, you reap more than what you sow. This can be an exciting news if you're sowing a good seed, and this can be frightening if you're sowing the wrong seed. So let me say this, before you think of gossiping, before you think of sowing discord, before you put anything into the ground, Remember, it's not going to come out the same way. It's going to come out more than what you put in the ground. Principle number three, you sow in one season and you reap in a different season. Paul said, don't get tired. Don't get weary in well-doing. For in due season, you will reap if you do not faint. When you put your seed in the ground, spend time to not joy it. Don't ever think I've been doing so much and it looks like nothing is coming out of it. Don't get tired. Don't give up. God is working on your behalf. God is working behind the scene, I want to encourage you today to make a conscious effort to sow the right seed so your harvest can be beautiful.